So, <laughs> so I'm gonna be, gonna be real here. I hope no one in the room is a race walker. And I know there was a PAX keynote where you're not supposed to shit on anyone else's joy. I'm gonna shit all over race walking. <laughs> and it deserves it. Race walking is a sport. Technically. Where you walk as fast as possible. And by walking, the rules are that you have to keep your front leg straight and at least one foot has to be touching the ground at any given point. So you That's the difference this. between, you know, like a horse. A horse has like a gallop and a tree. You know about horses in Texas, right? Yeah. So horses have different gates. A human has different gates too. Yeah. We have walking, we have walking, skipping, jogging, running, just like, you know, a horse, right? Yep. So all of them except for walking involve at some point during the leg motion, both feet being off the ground at the same time. When you skip, you have a little jump. When you jog, you sort of have that moment where you switch legs and there's a time period and there were both legs. And when you run, you're basically jumping forward, right, with each step. Only with walking are both feet always on the ground at all times. Or at least one of the two is on the ground at all so, times. So, and people might have already noticed this, though. What's going on here? What is going on there? Zoom and enhance. <laughs> that is the picture on Wikipedia about race walking. <laughs> it turns out that everyone cheats at race walking. Because if you truly walk and keep one, at least one foot on the ground at all times, there's a limit to how fast you can go, obviously. You can calculate it by the length of your legs. So race walking without cheating would simply be a leg measuring contest who has the longest leg. <laughs> we can do that a little bit faster with a tape measure. We can indeed. I mean, so, you might get tired if the race walk is really long. Okay. It is actually pretty tiring. Sure. To be fair. It is. But Depending on the, if it's the, marathon length. The rules of race walking, we talk about bad officiating in soccer. Soccer is fine compared to this. The judges are not allowed to bend over to look more closely. The judges are not allowed to use cameras. They're not allowed to use mirrors. They're not allowed to use binoculars. And they have to like go talk to each other and use this flag system to even detect that someone's cheating and report it up and disqualify someone. And if a cheating person crosses the finish line before the judges take action, they win. You can't do anything about it. So if you're near the finish line of a race walk, just freaking sprint. <laughs> what are they gonna do? Race walking is an Olympic sport. 